Oh, to the amazing Phillies and Yetta early in the part of the show. Now, it's time for our salute to the champions. It's brought to you by the Vancouver Province and sticking with the two best Phillies in the country. You're going to be looking at the 2009 Preakness and the amazing victory by Rachel Alexander. The salute to the champions is brought to you by the Province Sports, where you can read Tommy Walski's column, Hoss Talk, every Friday. The Province Sports, it all starts here. <laughs> And they're off in the Preakness. McDrama gets off to a good start. Musk and Matt is there too. Here's Rachel Alexander on the far outside, Pioneer of the Nile. And Friesen Fire has some early speed too. So they pass by us for the first time. And Velasquez is taking big drama well out into the track. Farthest out though, it is Rachel Alexandra. They're taking a bit wide going into that first turn here. Friesen Fire is third, Pioneer of the Nile is fourth. Take the points. Is fifth on the outside as the Philly gets loaded wide. Then Papa Clum was down six toward the rail. General Quarters is seventh and Musket Man is eighth. And then it's toned it down as winning ninth on the outside. A break of five back to Wayne Lucas's two runners. Flying Private and Love Go. And they're followed by Terrain. And mind that bird. The Derby winner, where he was in the Derby at this point, he is last. Now about 12 lengths from the lead. Strong enough is the pace for him to run into. It was a 46 and three half mile. And the Phillies in front. She's in front early on here. Rachel Alexandra narrowly, big trauma, still going to stay right with her all the way. Freeze and fire looms back in third position. Half mile to go in the Preakness. On the inside, Papa Clem runs along in for it. Far outside, Pioneer of the Nile. Now running in fifth. From the back of the pack, mind that bird. 13th, 12th, 11th, and he's 10th now. And there's three furlongs to go. Mind that bird beginning to roll. Around the far turn here at Pimlico, Rachel Alexandra. The leader, the leader by two as the field turns for home. Big drama running in second now. My net bird looks for a way through and he had to go way outside for it. Musket man toward the inside. Rachel Alexandra's in front with one furlough to go. Musket man moves to second. My net bird is third on the outside. The Philly trying to hold on. She's clear by three. My net bird runs at her leg. Here's the wire. And the Philly did it. Rachel Alexandra has defeated the Kentucky Derby winner. Mind that bird by three quarters of a league. Okay, that's it. Up the Sporty Kings, two things to leave you. Remember to keep them straight or we will get you on that final turn. Enjoy the weekend. Today on our Vancouver Province Salute to the Champions, and with this being Preakness Day, we thought what better time than to look back just two years. Year 2007, we're going to watch perhaps one of the top horses of this decade. That would be Jess Jackson's Curl and enjoy this magnificent horse. The Salute to the Champions is brought to you by the Province Sports, where you can read Tommy Walski's column, Hoss Talk, every Friday. The Province Sports, it all starts here. They're in the gate for the Preakness, and they Exchanger gets off to a good start, so too. King of the Roxy is there. Hard spun and flying first class, and CP West is with the Vanguard. Under the line for the first time, and it is flying first class. Exchanger's there to his inside. Hard spun going to be caught three wide going into that clubhouse turn. He's trying to tuck in behind there, and yes, he's got a good spot. Hard spun runs in third. King of the Roxy is fourth, CP West is fifth on the outside. Curlin is sixth, followed by Street.
Street Sense on the outside. Mint Slope toward the rail. Street Sense forced to take to the outside there. And the last of them all is Circular Key. So they make that way into the back stretch run now. And it is Exchanger who leads the Freakness Field. Flying first class there on the outside. And it's five lengths back to Hard Spun third. The quarter and 22 and four. Here's the half. 45 and three fifth seconds. Gut wrenching fractions here. Up the back stretch run. Five for lunch to go. Exchanger, Charlie. Now, don't forget, today is Preakness Day, and the only place to really watch them with all your friends is right here at Hastings Race Course. Enjoy the weekend. Remember to keep them straight. Oh, you know what? We might get you on that final turn.